industry and market analysis. Here is another section of your business plan that displays how knowledgeable you are about the business industry you operate in. It is expected that during the research stage of your business plan, you must have gathered enough data that will inform your business decisions and strategies. A market analysis is a quantitative and qualitative assessment of a market. It looks into the size of the market, both in volume and in value, the various customer segments and buying patterns, the competition, and the economic environment in terms of barriers to entry and regulation. Your market analysis should capture the below points. 1. Demographics and segmentation. 2. Target market. 3. Market need. 4. Barriers to entry. 5. Regulation. Demographics and segmentation. Demographic segmentation is market segmentation according to age, race, religion, gender, family size, ethnicity, income, and education. Here you discuss the demography you are reaching out. Please, you should give an estimate in number of the overall market and the number you are reaching or percentage of the bigger number you want to reach. Target markets. The target market is the type of customers you target within the market. For example, if you're making clothes, you can decide to target customers of all backgrounds or just the rich, middle class, or people of a particular tribe. If you're making aguada, then apparently you will target the rich people in the demography you've chosen. Market need. Here, you need to get into all the details of the drivers of demand for your products or services. One way to look at what a driver is, is to look at a food delivery business for instance. Most working class people who work in firms where food is not provided will rather have food vendors deliver food to them than leave their offices in search for food. So you need to expressly let the investor know why there is demand for your product or service in a very clear and concise manner. Barriers to entry. This section is all about answering two questions from your investors. One, what prevents someone from opening a shop in front of yours and take 50% of your business? Two, having answered the previous question, what makes you think you will be successful in trying to enter this market?